So I wanted to kick off by asking, uh, the cut mall scenes have been making the rounds this week. Everyone yeah. seems to love them. Yeah. And I was wondering if maybe you could tell us what it was like to shoot those because the like, response has been overwhelming. Really? I just saw it yesterday, like kind of quickly, so I'd like to sit down and watch it more. But it was awesome. It was really fun um, to shoot those. That was our first day working on the whole project. So we were all meeting each other for the first time. So that was really cool. And the arcade was fully functional. So whenever they were setting up different shots or anything, the four of us would like run away and go play video games. So it was really, really fun. It was huge. They, that was a real mall. That wasn't like a, no, yeah, like that wasn't a set or in like in a studio or anything. That was real. And it was awesome and huge. Yeah. Okay, so um, were you disappointed though when it didn't make the final cut? Yeah, I was. I didn't, I, I saw the film, the screening of it before we did our London press tour, like, like a day before we saw it. And I was disappointed because like obviously, I, like we worked for a couple of days on it, I think. Um, and I just think it's such a cool scene, like little montage. So I was disappointed, but my disappointment turned to happiness because now it's in the DVD. That's why you should go buy it. Yeah, because everyone <laughs> was saying when it came out they wanted the Jubilee cut of the film. So yeah. The remote cut, which came out yeah. Days of Future Past. So it yeah. must be nice for you to see how everyone responded to your character. Like yeah. Every, everyone has been like so super positive. Um, yeah, they've, they've been very good to me, but... Um, I was really happy that it made it in. I want to see it again now that we're talking about it. <laughs> I want to see it. Now, in the movie, you obviously had Jubilee's iconic yellow jacket. Uh -huh. But next time around, you're hoping to see her in like an actual superhero costume? Yeah. So I was thinking about that. I really want to obviously have like one of those fighter suits, right? Their X suits. But I'm like, I still want the jacket. So how do I get best of both worlds? I don't know. The problem was she's had a few different looks in the comic. Yeah, I know. I'm wondering, like, maybe, I wonder if they should cut off all my hair and, like, you know, because she has, like, boy hair in the comics with, like, a purple streak. Remember? Yeah, they do. Yeah, <laughs> Generation X, I think. Is yeah. 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 And she's not wearing yellow. She's she wearing, like, black and there. purple. But it's still kind of cool. And, of course, she's a vampire at the moment. So is that something you're intrigued about, maybe exploring down the line? Or you were thinking of this, yeah. this film? I think it'd be cool, like, if there were to be more films, it would be cool to have her as a vampire. Um, I don't do well with blood, so we'll, like, go down that road if it comes, but that would be fun. She's cool. I want bangs. Yeah. <laughs> a, a New Mutants movie is on the way. Yes. Um, Josh Boone, and that's, no one quite knows who's going to be in it yet. Mm -hmm. Is that something you'd be interested in, or are you more keen yeah. on the main sort of X-Men? Well, I don't really know what New Mutants is going to be about. I've heard, like, all these different, like, like read the blogs and stuff. But um, I definitely would be interested if, if they asked me. I know they're going to, at least rumor has it, they're going to try to, like, keep it in the franchise, right? Because they're all, yeah, yeah, they're all yeah. mutants. But that would be awesome, yeah. Hire me, please. <laughs> please. <laughs> of course, there's a lot of talk, although it's not confirmed, about an X-Men Avengers team up somewhere. Some point. Oh. How would you feel about that happening? Wait, are you talking about? I heard a rumor about like. Wait, Fanta are you talking about Fantastic Four? Uh, that too, as well. But obviously, people want the Avengers and the X. They want all the characters together, ideally. But all of them? That movie is gonna be like seven hours long. That would be epic because I love Robert Downey Jr. Mm. Like love, <laughs> love. Um, I would love that. That. There would be probably no screen time for anyone because there's like a thousand people in the cast, but um, it would be epic. Yeah. Can they do that though? That's DC and Marvel. Uh, it's Marvel, but it's Marvel Studios and Fox, I think. So it's a bit of a. Oh. It'd be a tough one, but people yeah. want to see it happen. So yeah. We'll see. But, um, you planted the idea in my head. Now I really. You just need to speak to the right people now. <laughs> get the idea further out there. Uh, did you manage uh, to like, grab anything from the set? And did I, are you asking me if I stole anything? Well, that would be illegal. <laughs> um, well, I so we tried on a bunch of different, like Jubilee wears like glasses or whatever, right? She wears pink glasses. I tried on a bunch of them. There was one that I wanted to keep, so I just asked them if I could take it, and they said yes. I wish I could have taken the jacket, though. And uh, finally, uh, it's the next X-Men film. It's been said it's likely to jump to the 90s now. 
Mm -hmm. So what in that period do you think you'd be excited to explore, whether oh it's fashion gosh. or pop culture? I mean, I was born in the 90s, so I can't really remember it. But, um, oh God, I don't know. What happened in the 90s? <laughs> I'm educated, I promise, I don't know. Coolness, I'd like to see epicness again. I don't know. Okay. <laughs> Any ideas for a villain you'd like to see in the next one? Or? Oh gosh. It'd be cool if it was like mutants against mutants, like mass groups of mutants against mass groups of mutants. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Instead of like one singular villain. Like big. Big. Team. I'm down for that. I'd like that. Awesome. That could happen. <laughs> yeah. That was great to meet you. Thank you great to meet you. Thank you so much. Ladies and gentlemen, you're watching Hey You Guys. Hey You Guys, huh? Is that from the Goonies? Nice. Hey!